day of camp. One hell of a hell of a camp we've had this time. Inspired a lot of kids. All teams smashed it. I cannot be more proud of the team we have put together. You know, myself and Calvis are obviously super stoked with the team we've got. I'm super stoked with the attendance. We are fully booked for the next two weeks, which is insane. And there's a waiting list. So hopefully we can get everybody involved, get everybody in and nobody is disappointed. A lot of smiley faces. I'm stoked, I'm stoked on life. We've built the dream and now we're living it. So yeah, I don't know what else to say. I mean, we, we smashed the build out uh, quicker than our schedule allowed for as well. So we had some time to, you know, get some team bonding involved and, and get to know one another really well, which was beneficial to start the camp because we've come into the camp now knowing how each other work, our personalities and things like that. It's been amazing. And obviously each and every one of our coaches and athletes has bonded with the kids and, and understood their needs on, on what they, they want to achieve, whether it's progression, just having fun, just making sure everyone stays safe and has a smile on their face. It's amazing. Thank you so much, Bossa. My man, thank you. thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. My guy. Yeah, have a good day. Thank you, boss. Thank you, boss. You're welcome. Have a good day, my man. <laughs> what a sound geezer. Oh shit, it's cold, eh? And that's it guys, our trip here in Saudi is finito, finished, done, out here. Calvis, let's go. Hey, I'm Calvis, let's do it. Four and four ski, let's go. Every time, this is becoming a thing now. <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> yeah, it's been amazing. And it's we're gonna be amazing. back again in two weeks. So I'll see you guys when we land back in the UK. Let's go. So we're back in the UK, landed in Heathrow Airport yesterday morning and then that day was pretty much a write-off. Today, we start fresh, we hit the ground running, we've got plenty of projects back in the UK going on, and I only have a limited time to do it before I fly back out to Saudi, and I'm gonna take you guys with me because, well, you ain't gonna to wanna to miss it, it's gonna be insane. I've got projects going on for myself, Dragon Energy, 414, shit's a madness right now, and time is of the essence, and I'm not trying to waste anything. So, I'm on the way to go see my guy, Philippe. Link is in the description below. He is a music artist and producer. So if you're in that industry, he is the guy you want to know. Anyway, I haven't seen my guy for like eight months. So I'm super excited to go link up with him. And then later on, we're going to go get a tattoo. And I'm going to bring you guys with me as well. So, cheers. Oh man, I'm gassed. Anyway, back in the UK, of course it's raining, but I'm actually stoked to see so much greenery. After being in the desert, you just see palm trees and the rest of it's just sand. I ain't trying to diss it, I love it, but the contrast between the two is 10-10, love it. Let's go. Let's try and remember to drive on the left-hand side of the road though and not on the right-hand side. And there is central reservation, so I can't just do a U-turn as and when I please. So, just keep that in mind. <laughs> anyway, let's go, let's get on with the day. Jeez. Back from Saudi, got a quick link up with my boy. On, let's go, we're gonna go for a quick whiz around town in his whip, let's have it. Tattoo later, non-stop, let's go.
actually a monster. It sounds good, man. What was the latest thing you just done to me? Uh, just the APR intake. APR intake? Yeah. Now, can you feel the difference? Wow. Let's go! So while I was out in Saudi, I was getting videos from Phil like I was just doing another madness on the road. <laughs> I've not seen my boy for six months, you know. and we are at Adrenaline Alley Skate Park. Gonna try and remind myself how to ride a skate park because for the last three weeks, all I've rode is mini ramps with no pads just because in Saudi, it is far too hot to be wearing pads when you're riding. So there, I've built the bike up today. I have also bought a drone as well. I know I said when I hit a thousand subscribers, I'm gonna buy a drone, but I figured why wait until I have a thousand subscribers to then start producing mad content when I can just produce mad content for those of you that do subscribe already and if I haven't made a thousand subscribers yet then it doesn't matter I'm still going to produce the best content I could possibly produce anyway so if you're watching this and you haven't subscribed hit that subscribe button but for now let's go have a session and uh, tomorrow we're going to unbox a drone and, and try and learn how to fly it so let's go back in adrenaline alley let's go we've got ethan here oh how's man saying? how's it going we're having a quick pole jam sesh so let's get a couple of clips on the on the pole jam all the times we have a session here i've never actually hit this thing so let's see what we can get we've got peter shredding in the background we'll get him involved as well let's go it's good times was a sick session at Corby Adrenaline Alley as per usual. This morning my drone arrived, next day delivery, come on let's go. And I've come out on a mission to try and learn how to fly this thing. 
as um, I've never actually really properly f flew a drone before and uh, yeah hopefully I'll be able to stitch in some sick clips of me flying the drone from today yeah let's get on a let's get this mission underway and let's learn how to fly this drone let's go well miss I guess I'll be on my way now you just give me a